Yo, what's going on guys? Bobby here and today we have a really epic video for you guys So we recently did a mic 1v1 video and you guys really seem to like that It did very very well and I decided I wanted to do another one and maybe if you guys like this one as well We can do a really good 1v1 series where once a week We can pick a different brawler chosen by you guys and grab the best players at least in North America Hopefully maybe even the world and get them to 1v1 each other. So today we have a three-way 1v1 It's gonna be a Pam 1v1 between Kenny Alec and Kangarma who are the three best Pams that we came up with in North America It's going to be a really good challenge Everyone is gonna face each other one times and then the final two and best two Pams are gonna move on to the Pam finals to see who the best Pam at least in North America is so with that being said we're gonna hop into some games and let's get into the 1v1s okay so we're gonna start it right now three two one and here we go they're gonna start off now so Kenny versus Pam to start off, they're going to be using the first star power. So they're going to be using healing star power. So they get a little bit of HP every time they get a hit. I'm not sure exactly what the number is. It might be 20. That's what I think it is or 40. Um, can't tell what it is right now. So it's a pretty even game right now. I probably suspect it's going to be the first one to get turret. But you guys are going to see eventually they're going to get closer to each other. Once one gets turret, they're going to get a little bit more aggressive. And you guys are going to see some really intense close Pam gameplay. So right now they're kind of just chipping away so you can get more value. They're pretty much at an equal point right now. And we're just trying to not interfere. So you guys can see they're popping their gadgets. Trying to take out each other's turrets straight away. Kang's going to get one hit on me, but that's fine. Kenny's doing a really good job. We're trying to stay out of the way. And Kang's going to be able actually to take that first one. Now Kenny is not very well known in the NA community. But he's a... Or not in the NA. Sorry. On the YouTube community but at least with the top na community he's known as a very very skilled pam player he's very good at pam and wins tons of pam 1v1s and he's kind of popping off right now he's doing a really good job at getting back into position so now it's backwards shooting and now both of these players do play a fair amount of showdown i think kenny does play a little bit more so he might be more used to backwards shooting as you guys can see he's kind of catching up right now um but kang is doing a really excellent job i believe they both have one gadget left it looks like Kenny has zero left right now, and we're just trying to not get in the way. Kenny's doing a really good job at getting another turret. So you guys can see they're really going at it right now, going really, really well. We're going to try and stay out of the way. It looks like Kang does have a lead. Now they're back to forward shooting. Um, they don't have any gadgets left, I believe. I believe they've both used three. And with 50 seconds left, I think Kenny's just going to reset it and get all of his HP back. He knows Kang is in a better position with that turret. So let's see how it goes. So Kang's doing a really good job right now of holding Kenny back. Uh, but Kenny is able to get his turret. Kang's going to put an aggressive one. And now Kenny's going to go right into Kang's face. Although it's not looking too good for Kenny. And he's going to go down again. And Kang's going to be able to pick up that kill. So 2 nothing right now for Kang. It's looking really, really good. Uh, we have Kenny coming from the bottom. But in a Pam 1v1, it is very unlikely that Kenny's going to be able to get two kills in this little of an amount of time. Um, and Kang might be able to actually pick up another one right now. Kenny's fighting for his life at the moment. But I don't think anything's going to end up happening unless it's just Kang getting a kill. It looks like Kang's going to get that kill. It's going to be a 3-0 wing for Kang Garmo. We're going to try and put the ball in the net. We're going to be able to. And that is going to end the first 1v1. So it is going to be one win for Kang Garmo. Zero wins and one loss for Kenny. Now let's move on to Kang Garmo versus Alec. Okay, so we're about to start the next one. My cold super is going to start it off. So here we go. This means that they could start. So we have Kang versus Alec. So Alec obviously being my pro teammate. I'm kind of rooting for him low key, but I'm kind of just rooting for better, better content to be honest. Alec's doing a little bit of a spin. It looks like he's going to be pushed back straight away and Kang has his number right now. Kang is doing a really good job. And if Kang gets this win, he's going to move on to the Pam finals. So pretty high stakes here for, Kang, uh, for Pam. I didn't mean Pam, I meant Kang, but Kang is going to absolutely clap Alec right there. So that's going to be a pretty crazy start to this. Um, not even, you know, 15 seconds in, he's able to get a kill. Alec is going to be able to get his Pam turn. Now playing with Pam, or not with Pam, I keep getting mixed up with Alec. I know he's a very, very aggressive Pam. So he's just going to try and go right into your face. Like just absolutely destroy that auto aim button. And just see how much damage he can do now he's kind of popping off over here he's doing a pretty good job i'd say it's basically even right now because pa or alec does have that turret but kang actually right now does look like he has a little bit of a lead 
Alec doing a really good job keeping his turret up. I'm not trying to be hit by any of Kang's shots. It looks pretty equal right now. Alec is doing his best to stay alive, but I think without a gadget, he's going to go down, which he will now. And it's going to be 2-0 now for Kang. So Kang is doing really good. He seems to be the Alpha Pam of today. Um, unless Alec can come back, which I'm not sure if he can. I wasn't keeping track of the gadgets. I think Alec has already used them all. He's not going to be able to. So Alec's actually doing a really good strat of half getting in front of his turret and half not. Oh, he did use a gadget. Okay, so that's pretty good for Alec, actually. He's doing a fairly good job. Oh, he's going to walk into about every single Kang shot over there, and Kang's going to win by two health. So Alec actually did a really fantastic job, like, you know, half taking the shots, half not taking the shots, and letting Kang kind of just soak a little bit of damage. But he did get hit by every single bullet there, so he's going to go down. It's 3 nothing right now for Kang. So Alec is just going to do his best to get a kill, see if he's the only one to get a kill on Kang. Kang is running away from turret, which probably isn't the best strategy, but Kang is going to eat every single shot over there, or I mean Alex, sorry. So Alex is going to have to get a full clip. He almost does it. He's going to be able to get a kill. Oh, they're actually going to tie. So Alec is going to be able to get a kill over there, but it looks like that is going to end this 1v1. It's going to be a 4-1 finish. So again, Kang is able to win by three, but Alec was able to crack that fortress and finally get the kill on Kang. So it's going to be Kang 2-0 is going to move on to the PAM finals, and it's going to be Kenny versus Alec to see who plays Kang in that finals. So let's hop into it and let's see what happens. Alright, so we're about to start the final 1v1, just waiting for Alec to get back to full health. Alec is full health, we're gonna put a smiley face, Colt down that middle, and this means starts. We got Kenny versus Alec over here, going for that second place spot. Well, not the second place spot, I guess second place into the final. So really even start right here. You can already tell the difference in Pam 1v1s. You guys can see Kenny has a little bit more of a passive strategy, is where Alec and Kang both just walked up as fast as they can. Kenny, you know, this is pretty equal, equal right now. I don't really know who's winning. I'm trying to stay away from all this action over here. Um, oh god, this is crazy. I'm trying to stay away, but trying to watch as well. Alec needs to get super. He's probably going to go down. He's able to get it. He's in the corner. So we're just trying to watch this. Oh god, they went right into a corner. I can't believe they already went in there. Alec is going to auto aim me. That's kind of toxic, Alec26. And he's going, and Kenny's going to be one shot. So if Alec didn't hit me... He would have been able to get that kill. So that's a little bit unfortunate over there uh, for Alec. But he is going to go down. Um, maybe my fault. Maybe not. I can't tell at that point. But Alec is going to do a pretty good job of getting back out of spawn over here. Oh, he's actually dishing it to Kenny right now. Doing a really good work with the damage. He's actually conserving a gadget right now, which is really good. He might be able to use it here. He's going to use it. I think he's doing a really fantastic job on Kenny right now. He's going to take out that turret. Really good work over here. Alec is definitely putting it in. Oh, he needs a turret right now, though. He's going to be able to get it. And it's pretty equal right now. No one is really winning by too much. It looks like Kenny is a little bit of a lead. But when Alec, oh, Alec is actually going to save some shots and get some HP. He needs a turret right now to stay alive, though. He's going to be able to get it. Kenny isn't going to be able to get a turret. Alec is going to hide behind his, and he's going to be able to get a kill. So that was really well played over there by Alec. Alec is definitely one of the highest IQ players in the game, and he definitely played that one to perfection over there. So 30 seconds left. It is a 1-1 game right now. So it probably is going to be whoever gets this next kill wins. Alec probably doesn't want to wait around, so he's just going to go in fully. Kenny does not have his turret right now, so Alec is doing a really good job um, of kind of just pushing him. 20 seconds left. Alec is doing a fantastic job. Alec is going to try and take out his turret over there, and from Alec's lead, it now turns into Kenny's lead. So Alec might just have to settle for a tie over here and hang on. He needs to get his turret. He's able to get it. He's probably just going to go for the tie. That would probably be the smart play. Oh, he might go down. He's going to go down with three seconds left. Alec goes down and Kenny is going to take that second place spot. Now, if Alec did auto aim Kenny or yeah, Kenny instead of auto aiming me, I believe he actually would have won that game, but he did go for me. So he's going to take the L. Might be my fault for getting too close. Might be his for getting too close to me. I'm not sure, but Kenny's going to move into that finals game against Kang. So let's hop into it. And let's see who the best Pam in NA is. All right, so here we go into our final game. This is going to be the finals. Kenny NG versus Kang, and that has signaled the start. 
So I think this is going to be a really interesting one. I don't think Kang is going to walk away with this one. That's just my prediction. And a really aggressive and good start over here by Kenny. Pushing Kang already into a corner. Winning the HP battle. It's going really well so far. And he actually is going to be able to pick up a kill in like 20 seconds. So that's pretty crazy. That's a pretty unbelievable start for Kenny. So things are looking really, really good at this point. So let's move down over here. And Kang and Kenny are still going to be going at it. Kang's going to throw that turret up. I'm going to try and count gadgets here for you guys so we can see who has the advantage because gadget is very important in this HP battle. Um, it looks like neither have used one. So Kang has used one and Kenny has used one. So it's pretty even right now. Kenny's going to take out that turret, but while taking out the turret, he's going to take a lot of damage. Kenny uses his second gadget. Kang is trying to preserve gadgets over here. Um, he's doing a really good job at it. And Kang's going to be able to get the kill. So it's 1-1. One, one. Gen er, Kenny has used two gadgets while Kang has only used one. So Kang is the clear, you know, winner right now. Um, let's see how things are going at the moment. So it's pretty even, you know, they're kind of just working their way to each other. They're trying to just kind of feel each other out and see how they want to attack each other. We're seeing if they can get the edge from distance before going in. So again, remember Kang does have that extra um, gadget, which might come in handy a little bit later. He doesn't want to waste it though. He's probably going to use it when he's a little bit lower. So it's overtime right now. Nobody's got their turret. So it's just a clear auto aim battle right now. And Kenny's actually going to come back on Kang and HP purely in that little auto aim exchange right there. And Kenny's actually going to be able to get some really good value. Kang is going to have to use his second gadget over here, which he had saved, which was a very good idea for sure, which he's going to be able to kind of get back to equal health, but a, a little bit down right now. Kenny should probably try and keep Kang low. Shouldn't let him uh, heal up. He might use his gadget i don't think it's necessary right now i think kang's definitely got to get a turret or else he's going to go down he's going to be able to keep himself alive he's doing a really good job and kenny did move out of his turret so he did lose a lot of value right there so it's kind of even right now kang is working his way back he's going to juke actually over there so things are going pretty well kang is working his way back i believe both pam still have one gadget left um it looks like it's just going to be a clear battle right now kang does it has his turret right there kenny does it oh and Kang's going to be able to get it. So five seconds left Four. is this going to be a tie? I don't believe it will. Oh, it will. So it's going to be a one, one tie. So we have the decision of either letting them tie or going into a game. I think what we're going to do is do the first one to get a kill in the next game. So it doesn't take too long. So a sudden death first to get a kill is going to be the winner of the Pams. We're going to tell them the message and we're going to hop over into our final game. All right, here we go. So we have the finals about to start. Kenny versus Kang. The first kill is going to win since it's a tie. And here we go. They're going to start into it. So expect a lot of gadgets being used basically straight away because there's no point of saving gadgets. It's probably going to be a while before we can get this first kill. So it's definitely going to be super intense. So Kang is doing pretty good. You know, Kenny's doing pretty good. It's kind of a competition right now of who can get their turret first. And it looks like Kenny might be winning that competition by a little bit right now. Really good spacing by Kenny. Kang is going to get a pretty decent clip from the range over there. And he's doing a pretty good job. So Kang is actually going to be first to get a turret. So that's a really good start. He's going to put it right in the mid. And he's not going to let Kenny do anything. Now Kenny's actually running into his net. Which I don't think is a really great strategy. But you know it is what it is. Kang's going to immediately use one gadget. Kenny's still got one. So Kang is already at a loss right here. He's going to take out that, uh, that turret 100%. He's definitely going to try and save and get some value right here out of his uh, turret that's already existing before putting out another one. And he's going to use a second gadget before Kenny uses one. So this is a huge lead right now for Kenny. Kang might have to do some work really soon or else he's going to be pretty screwed, I think. Kenny's probably going to use a gadget now. He's going to definitely use one. Kang, again, still has one gadget, but that's going to be his last one used right there. Kang is a pretty good lead. They're going to be in an auto aim fight over here. And remember, Kenny has two gadgets and Kang has zero. So Kenny is the clear lead over here. Kenny's doing a really good job in the 1v1. Kang is able to stay alive ever so barely. He definitely has to get his turret right now or else he's going to be kind of screwed. He's going to be hit by a lot of clips. He's definitely close to it right now. Oh, and he's going to be killed. And just like that, the champion of the Pams is going to be Kenny NG. So we're going to put that ball in the net. Kenny is going to get the W and that is going to be it. So congratulations to Kenny for being the number one Pam. Although Kang might have looked like the better Pam today and he might have, you know, had the better record, might have had the better KD. 
it's going to be Kenny that's going to come out victorious. So maybe two winners and Alec is just the loser today. But anyways, that's going to be it. And if you guys enjoyed these 1v1s, definitely let me know in the comment section below. And let me know what brawler you guys would want to see next. But that's going to be it for today. I will catch you guys again tomorrow. See you guys then. Peace.